Well, I'm back. Hello everyone and welcome to another update vlog. I know it's been a while since I posted a video on my channel here. Uh, it's been about three months since I posted a real video. There was that temporary update vlog that's now removed because, well, now you have the full update vlog to cover everything. Hopefully better than that temp one did. But, uh, yeah. So, a lot of things have been going on. I've been going a while and there's a lot of things to discuss. Pretty much lots. So uh, I want to try and keep this vlog brief. So if you just want kind of like a short version of what's been going on, um, I took a break from videos because I needed a break and now I'm back and things should pretty much go back to normal more or less. So yeah. Also I would like to mention now at the start of the video that I do have two other update vlogs linked in the description for my other channels. I have two other channels now that I'm going to be doing hopefully actively. The first one's to my uh, second channel, my gaming channel, and the other one's to my new RuneScape channel. So if you're interested in either of those I suggest you go check out their respective update videos as well. So yeah. But there's a lot of things to cover. Uh, there's going to be some changes to my schedule and series, uh, some stuff about, you know, live streaming my other channels, and the big one that I bet a lot of you are wondering where I've been for, you know, a good fourth of a year. So, uh, yeah. So, where have I been? Well, like I said, I took a break, and the reasons are, well, a lot of things. But pretty much, I just was getting stressed, burnout, and just needed a bit of a break to deal with things. It kind of started back in August. You're bit before that pretty much I think it was the end of June I finally got cable internet and since then I mentioned a few other vlogs around the time I just wasn't as into doing videos or just it just wasn't as much of a priority to me I just was kind of relaxing enjoying having cable and finally being able to do a lot of stuff I've been waiting years to do and I took a week off to work some stuff or work with some stuff I think in August or such I don't remember when it was uh, let me actually just go check real quick as I talk because I have my other browser up here. Pretty much, I took some time off. I came back, I recorded the first episode of Untamed, or the last episode of Untamed, the first one of the week. And, uh, let's see. Uh, do, do, do. And, yeah, it was August. I took, like, the first week of August off. I came back, I posted an update video, a mini game, and one episode of Untamed. I was going to record Besiege, because I wanted to start doing, uh, non-Minecraft games for my Tuesday-Thursday uploads sometimes, or... Just a new thing I wanted to start trying, bringing other gaming back to the channel. More on that later. But, uh, I was going to record Besiege. I had, like, the time to record it. I just didn't want to record it. And at the time, I was only recording things a day in advance. So, because I didn't record it, there was no episode. And I didn't want to kind of rush to get an episode out and post it the same day. And I also didn't feel like recording Untamed. And it just got to the point where I was getting a bit stressed. And I just decided I need to take a step back for a few things and you know, take a break from videos so I can kind of sort things out. And that's why I did. I took some time to stop, reflect on things, trying to read my notes and talk. But it kind of just was a point, I just wasn't sure what I was happy with and I didn't know what I wanted to be doing. If I still wanted to be doing videos, I was getting a bit depressed at the time as well because, you know, it's stressful trying to produce videos or daily videos and keep up with things and it just kind of gets you after a time. So I need some time to kind of sort that stuff out in my head. And yeah, I ended up deciding after a few weeks actually, it wasn't like I spent the past three months depressed or anything. It actually was over relatively quickly. It just took a lot of time doing other stuff. I'll get to that in a minute as well. But yeah, I decided in a few weeks I still did want to make videos, but there were a lot of other things in life and with videos that I wanted to get to first. I just didn't want to jump right back in and end up right back where I was because I didn't deal with things and just feel like I'm behind all over again. I want to take time and work on things and that's where I've mostly been. Another thing I want to mention, just because it was in my original notes, personally I kind of would like not to mention it, but when I was reviewing or reflecting on things, one thought that came to me is that it's kind of been like I've been living in my own shadow of things I've done in the past. One of the big things is Ascension, because that was my first big Let's Play. In my eyes, it's probably my best series I've done to date. I just really liked Ascension. You guys might disagree, you might think it was mediocre or whatnot, not that great of a Let's Play. I don't really care. It was really cool to me. I loved it. It was my first big Let's Play, and I feel since then I've been trying to do stuff that lives up to it, but to my standards, they just aren't as good. Like Untamed Chaos, it's a cool series, but I just feel it's lacking compared to what Ascension was. And I think I've also been trying to play it like Ascension, which is wrong. So I decided that I don't really want to try comparing to stuff in the past as much anymore and just try and focus on doing things the way I enjoy them or in try and enjoy the things I'm doing more. Like, I don't want to compare Untamed to Ascension. They're very different series. They should be played differently. So I'm going to play Untamed in the way I enjoy it 
and not as much in the way I think it should be played. More on that later as well. I'm gonna keep saying that pretty much. I guess the main thing is that I was trying to rush through on tape and focus on goals and not doing stuff that was fun. And with all the stuff I had to put in off camera to get stuff to, you know, progress with the mods, it just was a lot of work on me and it just wasn't enjoyable because it just felt like I was speeding through everything. The videos probably haven't been that entertaining when I did that either. Like when I have a list of 10 things I want to cr try and cram into an episode. That's not really fun and I think that's kind of what the series has been lacking. And I want to try and slow down the series and, you know, take a step back, do things more slowly, focus more on individual things. I'll cover this more later in probably a more understandable way. But yeah, so that's kind of what's been going on there. I just want to focus more on making the stuff I'm doing now the best it can be and in the ways it should be done and not trying to focus on making it like things I did before. In the future, I do want to do more series like Ascension. I have a plan for a 1.8 mod pack. That's not a sequel to Ascension like I originally planned, but should be more adventure pack like that should kind of fill my craving for more Ascension like stuff. So I don't know, there's a lot of plans for stuff like that in the future, but now's the present and I need to focus on the series I'm doing now. I want to finish all of them. So, or mainly it's just untamed, but I want to finish it and I want to do it properly, so yeah. So the last part on why I was away and what's been going on there is that there's a lot of things that just piled up, like, you know, just stuff like around my room, in my life in general, just things I say, oh, I'll get to that later sort of thing, and then so focused on making videos and that kind of stuff that it just gets put off for months. So those are the kind of things that I've been trying to do over these past few months. There was also some other things that came up, like my birthday back in October. Originally, I was going to try and just like work really hard, get a whole bunch of stuff done. Oh my god, I want to get all this video stuff prepared in advance. And I realized that that's kind of the opposite or kind of the reason I took a break in the first place was so I could relax. So instead of just trying to work myself a whole bunch, just kind of focusing on that and nothing else, I decided just to relax a bit more and not care if I'm missing time or not getting videos out sooner so I can enjoy my birthdays and the birthdays of relatives and all that stuff and uh yeah although for the past month I realized that um I just been getting a bit lazy and not doing as much as I should I really should just kind of get back and record stuff so now yeah because I kind of I guess it was the thing like took a month off that's not that big of a deal then I realized two months okay that's a bit more three months oh crap I really need to post videos again <laughs> so I don't know it hasn't been like that much really that's been going on. I just had a lot of stuff going on. I just had a lot of things I need to sort out. Hold on while I edit the notes. I probably should have done this between cuts. I had to separate them with spaces because it was just a wall of text otherwise and I couldn't really read it. So that's kind of where I've been. That kind of took a very long explanation. The other stuff hopefully won't take as long if you were wanting to stick around and watch the whole vlog. So yeah. But pretty much I just need a break. Just was burnt out. Hopefully I can get back to videos and not run into the same kind of wall and want to stop again or not be into it as much. But I have a lot of plans for not only this channel, but my other channels. So yeah, let's get into those. Okay, now to discuss what's going to be happening with my channel and videos. Well, like I said at the start of the video, things are pretty much going to be the same as before I took my break. My schedule's mostly the same, only one small change really. Uh, Untamed Chaos, my main series, is still going to be Monday, Wednesday, Friday, just like before. Uh, my secondary series is still going to be Tuesday and Thursday, and just to mention what it is, I decided to hold off on Besiege and go with Evoland 2, because that's what I was wanting to do at the end of August when it came out. I think it came out at the end of August or so. But I wanted to do Besiege first, but since so much time has passed, I decided just to jump right into Evoland 2. More about that in its first episode coming up, well, in a few days. Um, the only change is that my weekend videos. Uh, before, I did have mod spotlights on Saturday and was doing mini games on Sunday as well. I decided to make it an either thing, or like one or the other thing, maybe both, maybe none. I don't know, it's just the weekend videos that are the hardest for me to make and... I'm not sure what how I feel about the minigame series. I was also considering doing maps on Sunday, like shorter maps or map explorations. I don't know, but pretty much I want to aim to have at least one video on the weekend, Saturday or Sunday. If it's Saturday, it's always going to be a mod spotlight. If it's Sunday, it's going to be minigames or maps. So that's just kind of what I'm thinking to do for that. So yeah. 
And that's pretty much my schedule. Oh, also, I'm going to be pre-recording more. I pre-recorded, like, the first four episodes of Everland. And uh, I still need to record this week's Untamed episodes. But I plan to do, it like, a bulk recording session, probably, like, three Untamed episodes at a time. Or, I don't know, just to make it a bit easier for me to kind of stockpile and not be as like the day before because that's kind of one of the things that was really getting to me is that i was recording things so short notice before they went up recording this a few days before it goes up but uh i don't know it's just when i was recording things like immediately before they went up it was a lot easier to mess up and not get a video out so i'd rather have it kind of stockpiled and have it ready like a week in advance than worry about it like the day before although i would like to try and keep the time shorter so I can actually read comments and interact with that better, but it's more important I think I got the video out than respond to comments in the previous episode. I don't know, it's just kind of how I'm going about it now. But Untamed will be less pre-record than the other series, so I don't know, hopefully this all works out well. And I'm just trying to get to the point where videos are good for me and good for the viewers and just all around the best of all the options. I don't know, just kind of rambling a bit now. But yeah, my upload schedule is pretty much the same, just it's not going to guarantee a mod spotlight every week now, just because I haven't been able to keep up with that for a while anyway. But I hope to have at least one video out on the weekend. Might not always have a weekend video, but hopefully we'll have one. I would like to try and do some more mod spotlights and mods you must know soon, even though I've kind of been on a break or was on a break from. I would like to try and get some of them out and not just have a whole bunch of mini games or maps, but I don't know. And like I said, I'm still a bit unsure about the minigame series or the first episode just kind of felt eh to me. Like it didn't feel anything I really enjoyed and really wasn't that easy or at least if I do only record good games, it's going to be a while because it can take a while to get a good game of a minigame. I would also like to do more stuff with friends. Uh, this is one minigame some of my friends made called Creeper Spleef and if I can get a few of us together to record that, I would like to. We could even use TeamSpeak, although the audio quality for them might not be the best. But I don't know. Hopefully it will be enjoyable if I do get to do that. And uh, yeah, um, Untamed Chaos. I'll mention more of it when I record the episode for tomorrow or in that episode. But pretty much my plan is I want to make the episode shorter and more focused on a single thing. Because like I said, I had it before where I had like 10 things I tried to cram into an episode. But then I kind of did a bit more than I should, then the episodes ran long, and I don't know, I just want to focus a bit more on like a certain mod, like say Blood Magic. And like all I do this episode is Blood Magic, maybe some Tinker stuff, that's kind of actually my plan for one of the upcoming episodes. But hopefully that way I can have episodes shorter and just a bit more fun, not as kind of rushed feeling, and enjoy the series a bit more. Take it pretty much. I just want to take the series a bit slow and not try and rush to and finish it in so many episodes. I'm also not focused as much about the end game. Like, there's some mods I might not ever get to in the series or might not get as far in. Like, I might never get to the end game of Botania or Thaumcraft, and I'm okay with that now. But I don't know. I'll talk more about that in tomorrow's episode. But that's just kind of the plan. The episodes might run a bit shorter, but hopefully they'll be a bit more fun or just seem nicer or at least be better for me. So. Yeah. The other thing I want to mention is I'm still looking into ways to change my schedule expanded or cut back. Um, after editing the videos this past week, or at least Evoland, I kind of feel like if I do anything I would like to cut back. I think the only way I really want to expand it is having the maps as one of the videos I could do on Sunday, or at least doing more of that than just mini games. Because I would like to maybe do a third series, but... Untamed and Everland are a lot. I would like more variety, but I also do have my other channels to consider and I don't know, it's just uh, pretty much if I recorded four episodes in a night, then over the next two days I epi uh, or next two days I edited and rendered two episodes a day. That's four episodes in three days, which is still pretty much an episode a day. And that's a lot of work on my end to produce videos that much for this channel or near daily on this channel and twice a week on my other, once a week on another, so, I don't know, if anything, I would like to cut back, it's just, I feel bad about cutting back in a series, like, I like having Untamed three times a week, I like having Everland twice a week, or my secondary series won't always be Everland, currently it is, though, so, uh, yeah, I would like to cut back, I'm just not sure how, if things really do start to feel like it's too much for me, the obvious cut back would be going back to Monday, Friday, Untamed, and Wednesday for Everland, or the second series, I really don't want to go back to that because I feel like it's just not nearly as good as having the, you know, five a week dropping to three just feels eh. Or just feels mainly like it's too spread out and not focused enough. But I don't know. Let me know if you guys have any thoughts on that or if you'd be okay with that. You like it always is now. Just let me know. But 
I don't know, if it does get to the point where I feel like I'm doing too many videos or can't keep up with it, I would rather cut back than have none at all. And also, if I ever do go on a break again, I probably would go down to like a very bare minimal schedule of pre-record videos than nothing at all. That's kind of one thing I decide on because I feel really bad having three months of nothing. I'd rather just post like one untamed video a week than have nothing at all. So just uh, mentioning in case it happens again because I do have a bit of a tendency to take breaks from my channel and I doubt this is the last time but hopefully in the future I can handle it better and at least still have some content and not just like no mention of it beforehand because this is probably the worst time I went on break. Usually I mention it so anyway off topic again. I have a few more things to get through and hopefully keep this video under 20 minutes. It's probably already over 15. So uh the other thing is just some uh minor things to mention. Annotations. I put annotations back on all my mod spotlights because when I was looking at analytics over my break there just because I was curious and looking around at stuff on YouTube um, I noticed that my annotations over the past few months have still got like 500 or more clicks, which is a lot. But I haven't been using annotations for months. So since I stopped using annotations, they're still being pretty active. At least a few hundred clicks in a month or redirects, whatever there are for annotations. Cards, on the other hand, which I switched over to, had a total of two. So pretty much I learned no one uses cards. I mean, I'm not sure I want to get rid of them. At the moment, my plan is for mod spotlights, they'll still have cards and annotations. All my other videos will have cards. I might just switch back to all annotations. I just gonna feel bad about not having cards because they're how mobile users can use it because they can't use annotations. So I'm a little E there, but I don't know. It seems like annotations are better for videos than cards at the moment. Maybe cards will catch on in the future, but I don't know. This is a bit more of technical stuff. So if you have any opinion on which I do, let me know. They're both about the same amount of work to do. So I don't know. I might just switch back to all annotations. I might just keep on with cards. But for mod spotlights, I'll be doing both for the moment. So yeah. Another thing is my outro. Um, as part of pre-recording, I'm going to be changing the clips left less often. Probably not that big of a deal for you guys, but what I have been doing, I've been trying to use one of the most recent episodes within the past week. But like when I was uh, editing and rendering the first four Everland episodes, I haven't recorded the Untamed episode yet. So I had to put an older clip in the little outro video slot. So I don't know. Same for the mini games. You know, I haven't recorded that yet. So for what I just use my old outro or the old outro clips for the video was to redirect to. I'll re still redirect them to the most recent video. Like when I put the annotation or card there, it's going to be the more recent one. But the clips used in it are older ones. And I don't know. I do plan to update them every so often. But just in case any of you were uh, wondering or noticed that I keep using the same clips, that's why. So yeah. And the other thing is about ads. Um, I turned off some ads, the non-skippable ads. So, well, if those were annoying you, they're gone now. So, uh, I don't know, it's just, I wanna focus my channel more on growth than money, cause I really don't make much money from ads anyway. So I thought it was better if those ads were discouraging viewers, then don't have them. I don't really wanna say no ads, cause I would like some money for the, all the time I put in, but I don't know. If it becomes more of an issue or any of you really don't like having ads, let me know and I could turn more off. But for this video and onward, they won't have the non-skippable ads at least, which hopefully will be some of what of improvement. And the last few issues, finally here, my other channels. So my secondary channel, Bio Bonus, is now a general gaming channel, not just like a vlogging second channel. I would like to rename it something so it doesn't feel as much of a bonus channel. Like it's still going to be my second channel for anything I don't want to put here in a sense. But I also want it to be kind of its own thing. Like you could like that channel without watching this channel thing. And its current name doesn't really suggest that. It really seems like here's the leftover stuff. And that's not really what I want to go for. But uh, the plan for that channel is I'm going to be doing videos uh, twice a week and just kind of general gaming, shorter clips. Uh, that's where the FNAF and Race the Sun videos are going that used to be on this channel. I also want to do some other stuff there on the future. But you can see more about that in the update vlog on that channel that I mentioned at the start of this video in the description. So yeah, if you want to hear more about my... Uh, gaming channel by a bonus the link to that vlogs in the description that should sum up my plans for what i'm doing there then i have my runescape channel originally i was going to do old school runescape on my second channel 
but it's one of those games that you really need to know to enjoy videos on because if I just try to throw it in there with my other general gaming videos it just not wouldn't have worked well so I decided it really needs its own channel so I gave it its own channel it's gonna upload once a week maybe every two weeks depend how depends how much time I have to make videos so uh yeah so if you are interested in old school RuneScape videos, you can go check out that channel. And as with the gaming channel, the link to its uh, announcement video, update video, whatever you want to call it, is in the description as well. If you haven't heard of old school RuneScape or RuneScape before, just ignore it. Pretend it's not there. And it really shouldn't take away much from stuff I'm doing here. Or stuff I already was playing, so it's not that big of a distraction. So yeah, don't worry about me having three channels being like spreading myself too thin. I've been very careful to make sure I'm not doing that and considered it a lot over my break. And the other thing is the Crystal Alliance channel or the Alliance channel. That technically is my fourth channel, but at the moment, I'm not doing anything with it. I'm not sure when I'm gonna be doing stuff with it. I kind of want to do like mod pack demos of stuff I'm working on, you know, demos of different projects, like trailers for mod packs and stuff, but I don't know, I just haven't been wanting to record stuff for the stuff I have been working on. There just really isn't much to show. So it's kind of inactive. In the future, I would like to bring it back. I would also like to have other people from the Alliance actually help me. If you're unsure what the Alliance are, it's pretty much just a little group of friends I have who help with mod pack stuff or we do stuff relating to mods, mod packs. So I don't know, we just haven't really been doing a lot lately. Everyone's kind of been busy with their own thing, especially with me kind of being on break and for the past like month I just kind of been focusing on stuff and just kind of relaxing and not even chatting with anyone so pretty much for the last month I just been really lazy so uh yeah and the final thing to mention is uh live streaming I would like to live stream on Twitch it's again it's just I don't have much to stream at the moment like I don't really want to continue with uh, that one memory lane series I was doing. Pretty much everyone was playing on the server when I wasn't on and I just didn't really enjoy it that much anymore. I would like to do more in the future with like 1.9. I'll probably try doing a server with some friends with when that's officially released. I don't want to do the snapshots. So yeah, I also do want to do some old school RuneScape uh, streams. You know, I have that new channel for it and I don't know, it's pretty popular for streaming. So I thought I'd try streaming some stuff. It's just, I really don't have anything I want to stream on there at the moment either. So if you have any suggestions for stuff I should stream, let me know. Um, one thing I was considering is uh, Botania Garden of Glass. That's their Skyblock add-on for Botania, which I don't know, it seems pretty cool. I know I haven't used Botania a lot in Untamed, but I feel like if it was just Botania and Skyblock, I'd be forced to use a lot more to get stuff and that would make it more interesting. Maybe even could do it multiplayer with one of my friends. I don't know. If that sounds interesting, let me know. If you know any other Minecraft or even other, any other games you want to see me live stream, let me know and I'll consider it. As for Untamed live streams, I have no plans for them at the moment. I know some of you might have enjoyed them, but I don't know. It's just the stuff I was live streaming, stuff I would do off camera. I don't think these streams I did were particularly interesting. And if I do decide to bring back Untamed live streams, I might do it on YouTube because they have the new streaming stuff and it just, well, it's a YouTube series. It makes sense to stream it on YouTube. I don't know. So that's just kind of how where that stands. But I would like to try live streaming. I actually wanted to live stream like before I got back into videos or kind of with my return to videos. It's just I really don't have anything I really feel like streaming right now. So I'm not going to be streaming. And uh, one final little note, it's not actually all my notes, but uh, mod pack stuff. I have been working on an update for Untamed Chaos version 1.4. Uh, that should be out sometime around the end of the year, hopefully in December. After that, I probably will do one or two more updates before I stop supporting it. Pretty much, I'll keep updating the pack as long as I'm doing a series on it. But 1.7 is not really dying out, but I want to start focusing on other uh, mod stuff now and not just keep updating the same pack over and over. And it's just kind of one of those things when I'm busy with videos and everything, just taking uh, updating Untamed alone can take a lot of my time. So I don't want to invest all my time just constantly updating it because 1.7 mods keep up or mods update with minor stuff usually. So I don't know. There's still going to be more updates. I'm still supporting it for a while to come, but there are probably going to be fewer and far between. And yeah, I do want to uh, finish Moonlit Siege and have an update to Void Shadows before I kind of am done with 1.7 stuff, but I really want to get into experimenting with 1.8 and that new adventure pack I mentioned, and yeah. Anyway, that's it for this update vlog. This has been a lot longer than I expected. I think the time on the raw footage is around over 25 minutes now, so hopefully after editing it shrinks a bit, hopefully. So uh, yeah, but 
just to sum it up, I'm back. I'm doing videos again. I took a break just because I was burnt out and needed a break from videos to kind of sort through stuff. But I've done that. Now I'm back. I'm recording again. Things are pretty much the same. I have two more channels. You check that out in the description. And uh, yeah, hopefully things will continue from here and uh, be good for, well, a while to come. So uh, yeah, I'm back and goodbye.